got a great idea for a recipe. Bar food meet comfort food in this dish, which I happen to invent myself. But instead of the cheese and bacon bean garnishes, we're gonna be integrating them in the soup. But we're not gonna reach taste bud heaven if I keep talking, so let's go. Now, I save the best for last. Except I'm starting with it first. Bacon. Take one bag of bacon and cut it into bite-sized pizzas like this. Next, get yourself a pan and a spoon, a slotted spoon preferably, and add the bacon. In the meantime, grab yourself a plate, put the paper towel on it. So this is where all the bacon go once it's ready. Speaking of which, put the bacon down until it's nice and crispy. So once your bacon looks like this, scoop it out of the pan, place it on our plate. Oh, and to save the grease, you might need it. Next, grab yourself a six quart cookie pot. Then add to a small bowl, three quart cups of each of diced celery, onions, and carrots. The French call this a mirepoix, or a mirepoix. Now let's set this to medium heat. Add three or four tablespoons of unsalted butter. Add the veggies. Stir around so everything's coated nicely with butter. Once the onions soften up a bit, sorry, that's what I meant to say. Add three tablespoons of flour. Mix to combined. Now let's add a few pinches of salt. Some pepper. And a teeny bit of smoked paprika. Turn the heat to low and add one 32 ounce carton of chicken broth. Bring it to a boil. Once it does, reduce the heat down to a simmer. Slap on a lid. And let this cook for 30 minutes. The 30 minutes are up. Let's add one cup of heavy cream. Let's also add three cloves of garlic. Let's mix it all together with an immersion blender. Link in the description if you need one. Let's add one and a half to two cups of shredded sharp cheddar cheese. Oh, one thing about the cheese, Add it slowly. We don't want it to form one huge ugly lump. We have to add more than one type of cheese if we really want this to be good. So let's add some Parmesan. And half a cup of Gruyere cheese. Now let's add the potatoes. I just took two average sized potatoes. I cut them up into little bite sized pizzas like this and let's add it to the pot. Bring it to a boil and let this cook for 10 to 15 minutes. Once the 15 minutes are up, it's time to add the bacon. Is this soup tasty? You better believe it. Oh. Uh, anyway, once you try my soup, you'll realize why hasn't anyone done this before? Adding broccoli to cheese soup. Despicable. This has been Jay's Cutton Kitchen. I'm CRJ, making cooking fun and meaning it this time.